Okay, so uh, I've got AMP Droid running on my tablet here already. So what I'm going to do is I've got a couple of clients set up already, but we're going to go and set up just a new client. Uh, so we go up there settings, and then you can see clients there. So there's two two ways you can do it. Well, they're they're the ones that I have at the moment. Um, so there's a couple two ways you can do it. So you can add the host. If you click add host, you can go in and enter all the information in that uh, manually. So that also works. Um, but I find what's easier. So I go QR scan. It'll bring up the uh, scanning device on the tablet, and I'll zoom it in on the screen here. That's that uh, QR image I saved before. So what we do is if we put this up. Okay, so it's what you'll see here is that it's putting the information um, for us. So what I need to do now is I need to go use authentication, put in that username and password that I had before, that I entered before. So there, and then I'll put in the password. All right. Click done. Click OK. And we have the new client in there. So what we'll do now is we'll go back and we'll uh, go through it. And Okay so you can see it's now connected down the green the bottom here there's a green light that actually tells you it's connected. Um, so we'll go through and have a quick browse. You can see if I select remote on the tablet the new version the tablet here the left hand side is remote on the right hand side um, it replicates the screen, so that's pretty cool. So let's just we scroll down. So if I'm on pictures, say you also see up here that it actually tells you that you're on pictures, um, and you can see it on the screen there. So my TV series, moving pictures, and so on and so forth. So that's pretty cool. Uh, as you can see on the tablet version, on the right hand side here, you can see a list of. Um, the options as well, so you can go direct, so you, we can go straight to moving pictures, and you see it on the screen. Um, some of the the lists um, it can't show up on here, but um, so when you're on the screen there, we can go OK into the movies, and um, if I hit refresh here, it actually gives you a list of the shows that I've got there too. So. Um, that's pretty cool. If I select that one, for instance, you can see it on the screen. Or if I hold long press it, um, it'll actually. And then we get OK to play. There you go, so it's playing on screen. That's pretty cool. Um, I can slide that up. And um, that gives you like the metadata and so it's about the show, name of the show, you've got your volume here, you can mute your f some controls and this is um, options to mu music. So from here I can stop the show, I can fast forward um, by seeking, so I can scroll it and it's fast forwarding, I can pause it or to stop it I just long press the pause button and it stops the show. So then you slide that down again, um, go back, go back, go back, and back at the front. So you can you'll see. Let's pick up TVC. And again, you can see on the screen there, I, and it brings up the list. So that's pretty cool. And again, you can go directly into it, as you see on the screen. Um, press it. To play, and there you go, and there it is playing. Stop that. Go back. Sorry. Go back. Go back. All right. So um, there you have it. That's the uh, that's how to configure and um, set up um, Android.